And, and how's it worked for you to be on the telly? I mean, I suppose you've enjoyed it. You've learned a lot from it. What can you share? Uh, I think you know with with TV, it's it's tricky to get pub, you know productions that have the investment for uh, genuine shows, like mm. really genuine shows. Uh, and you know, one of the things I loved about the shows that I did uh, was that you know we were showing people's journey over a, over a couple week period. Uh, with in the middle of that period, they were doing a seven day uh, mind and body and soul detox, and it was like literally flying the wall stuff. They were, you were seeing everything and. People would contact me, and they would, they were they were very touched by the emotional stories that people were going through. They could really relate to when we were exploring the potential mind-based causes, and it led to some really good TV because people would be the the, the client themselves would be, would be it would be a blind spot for them, but the viewers would be like it's plain to the other person. It's this this is the cause, you know, and so just people observing that journey of of someone having this blind spot and then seeing that and having this breakthrough, and you know, for we had a guy called Paul, and he was quite overweight and he had psoriasis all over his body and then with a three month catch up it all gone. You know, we had Juliet who was uh, had al adult acne but she also had uh, a major fear of, of dirt. She was a compulsive cleaner. And you know, with her, it was amazing because we went back and found that the root cause of her compulsive cleaning was when she was racially abused in a subway tunnel, working, walking home from school one time. Oh, okay. yeah. And what happened was that, you know, she had this intense fear of death, of, of being attacked. But she also remembered there being it being really dirty in the subway tunnel, and the mind had made the association. And so when we collapsed that and healed that for her, she started doing pointer lessons with her kids and all the rest. Of it. And there's, there's some really inspiring little you know stories in these TV shows. And, mm. and and what was lovely about them for me was that I didn't have to do much marketing for about four years because <laughs> <laughs> people had seen it and they would just you know we'd be able to come along and I could focus my efforts on on helping people as opposed to trying to tell them about it all. You know. Mm. So TV is great for getting the word out.